So we just got done filming a short and uh, it started getting pretty windy outside. I mean, look at that tree. That is probably like the breeziest windy tree I've ever seen. And I know people will say like, oh, hey, you come from the Windy City, you know, Chicago. You should be used to the wind. Well, fun fact, the city of Chicago does not get its nickname primarily from it being windy, since there are many other cities windier-ist than it. Its politics are really uh, unstable, and that is where that comes from. Even though it has its windy days, um, this is kind of, like, random. This wind has been coming on and off, and the sun is setting over there. You can see, like, a little glimpse of it. Like a little bit, even though it's really blurry now. Camera has nothing to focus on. So we'll go back to the tree, wherever the tree's at. Where is that tree? Let me find that tree. All right, the camera has once more found the breezy, breezy tree. So it's been about it for uh, this pointless vlog. Um, had something else to say, and I can't even remember. But we'll see what happens. Things are going well here. I'll get more vlogs and stuff up in the not too distant future. Also, what's with like the one, like there's one street light in this whole area, like here, right over there by that tree. Like, I don't understand why there's only one. Where the hell are people supposed to deal drugs at around here? I have no idea, but that'll be about it. That short should be up in a couple days. It involves a bunny and some fun dip, and it'll be good times, ready to go. Speaking of the windy tree, look what all that wind blew in. A bunch of snow. After we had just gotten rid of like all the snow on the ground here, the wind blows in a snowstorm. It looks a lot worse than it actually is outside. I'm not sure how much snow we're supposed to get. But uh, randomly looked outside and then it's snowing. So there was the windy tree over there somewhere next to the one street light in the neighborhood. So. Whatever, looks a lot worse from the window because all the snow is kind of spattered against the window due to yield and wind, so we'll see if this snow can melt before the next snow comes in.